this way. I don't want to. Oh, I don't. At U.S. Cellular, connection is the greatest gift of all. Get one line for $29.99 a month with unlimited data. That's right, $29.99 a month, unlimited data, even for just one line. That's locally grown connection. Limited time offer, terms apply. Visit uscellular.com for details. Necessary in order for someone to have 218. But the bottom line is you got a lot of good warriors in this town, Freedom Caucus Centric, uh, guys like Bob Good, guys like Matt Gates, guys like, uh, you know, the, the whole Freedom Caucus will rattle them all off who are, who are having good conversations about what we need to do and we'll keep you all posted. So, but, uh, I, Jim, I'm, I'm, I understand that uh, if uh, the Senate is bombarded, if we would get the Senate, uh, and say, move away from uh, uh, Mitch McConnell, it will make a huge uh, difference. It, it would pressure anywhere. Who do we call? Do we call our local congressman? Do we call uh, Kevin McCarthy's office? What, what, what has to happen? What would be the best use of people's time? Every member of the United States House of Representatives need the American people to uh, have uh, called their office and told them that they want to change, that they want leadership, they want a fresh vision for where Republicans are going to take this country to set the stage for 2024, because it's now or never. Right now is the time. And Lord willing, we're going to have the gavels. We need that. We need that pressure. I would do it in the Senate. I would do that in the House. If you're listening across the entire country, call your congressman or congresswoman and tell them you want to see a change in Washington and let that you know, have the impact that I think it will. So, so should they say, we want a change in Washington, but we want a change of leadership? I would say that, uh, that we need new leadership in Washington. New leadership, okay. Thank you, Chip, I appreciate it. Thanks, Glenn. You bet. Congressman Chip Roy uh, from the great state of Texas. You know, I always forget this. How many senators do we have in Texas? Two. Two, and then one of them, I know one of them's Ted Cruz. Yeah. Um, wh wh who's it? The other one, it's, it's hard. He's only been in there since I was like a kid, I think. Yeah. And John, yeah. John, John, hmm. Corman, Cor Corman, Corman, Cor Corman, Cor something. He's, yeah. he's so dynamic. So dynamic and, and so always, notable and part yeah. of leadership. Yeah. Um, you yeah. know, I, I, I just, I, if we can't remember his name, perhaps I can, I can always remember <laughs> Chip Roy's name. <laughs> yes, That's a name I always remember. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. I'm just, yeah. it'd be interesting to see, you know, maybe someday we could have two senators that represented Texas. It would be nice. I know we're supposed to have two. I know we have one. Yeah. yeah. Do we have a second I'm one? I'm not sure. Doesn't I'm not seem sure. like it most of yeah, the time. Yeah, I, uh, I don't see him doing anything. Well, anything that is of great note for the Constitution mm. or the Republic. So Works very closely uh, with Mitch McConnell. Here's the thing. Know, that's important. I, I'm telling you, I, I have not said this to you uh, over the last probably five or six years. Call your congressman because honestly, I'm sick of it. I'm sick of it. But if we concentrate right now in the next couple of weeks and you call and call and call, if they feel the Republicans all across the country calling and saying, we want a change in leadership of the GOP and we want to see action, if we hold their feet to the fire, I have talked to enough congressmen like Chip just uh, said enough congressmen and enough senators to know that will make a difference. They're gonna hate 